Hey body rockers, welcome to day four of your 30 day challenge catching fire. Um, day four. Day one, everybody's always excited. It's something new, novelty. Yeah, here we go. Let's do this challenge. It's like a New Year's resolution. Day two, you know, you still have some of that pep in your step. I always find that by day four or five, at the end of the first week of people's challenges or New Year's resolutions or new week resolutions, people start to slowly, you know, die. What do they say? Old habits die hard. Their old habits start sneaking back in. Uh, the motivation starts to go down. By day four, if you're starting on a Monday, it's Thursday. Thursday nights are tempting for that glass of vino or, you know, your friends are calling you up or you might be so sore from days one to four that you're like, screw it. Remember, this is what makes that 2% of the population that's fit this is the part where they don't break. So don't break, don't fall, keep going. It's hard, and as I said, it's so worth it. And as cliche as it sounds, I see these you know little sayings going around, in six years, because I have a six year journey thus far, in six years, you're gonna be happy you started six years ago. So in 30 days, you're gonna be super happy that you pushed through the 30 days. So don't stop. Don't think about stopping. Don't think that you deserve, I hate, I've, I've worked so hard I deserve a piece of chocolate, glass of wine, and a day off. No, you don't. So, what you deserve is giving your body at least 12 minutes of your day to making it its optimal being. That's what you deserve. So, push through, don't give up. Let's go on day four. Day four, everyone, we're doing a time workout again, so get your timer ready once again, download it on your smartphone, get one, look at the clock, do what you need to do. Uh, we're gonna be doing 30 second works to 10 second reps, rest for six rounds, and we're gonna go through that three full sets for a full 12 minutes, 12 minutes of your day, dedicated to you and your body. So, we're gonna press start. Our first movement is just you and your body. It's really great for warming up, and it's a front back lunge. You're going into a front and a back lunge, and you're gonna go right back into it on the same leg, okay? So we're gonna start with the 10 second rest. When that beeps, we're ready to rock and roll. Day four, let's rock. Remember, if you're brand, brand new and the burning is going in that one leg, switch your legs, right leg. Left leg, that's gonna be that much easier. Here we go. So, right, and just continue on that same leg. This does require some balance, so I find looking at a spot in front of you, keeping your core tight is an imperative when talking about balance and agility work. So you'll be feeling actually the leg that's not moving. This left leg that's stationary is the one getting all that weight back and forth, back and forth. Go right into a 90 degree, push off that heel, go right behind you. Good. Now we're going to do the other leg. If you found that too difficult, by the time you get to three rounds, alternate your legs. I think I'm going on my left leg now. God, Rita. You'll know right away. If you don't know like me, you'll feel the burn and you'll know what you like you just did. Woo! And I'm right. Nice tight core, push through. Push up through the heel. Should be burning by now. If it's not, get lower in that lunge. Deeper, lower push. Use your legs. All right, here we go. 10 seconds off, I'm gonna go right into a, almost like a Spider-Man. It's a plank, really great for your core, but then you're gonna bring your knee in. So this alone should be challenging. From there, knee to elbow and back down. Knee to elbow, back down. You can do this from your knees, or you can speed this up if you really want to challenge yourself, and you can just slow it down. I found with core work, it's almost better to go a little bit slower. So you're activating more of those secondary muscles, those supporting muscles. I don't know, I went from one core movement to the other, but that's what we're going to do. We're gonna go into our uh, dip station and do some knee up. So hold your upper body and go right through with the knees up and back down. This is great for upper body as well as core. 
If you're getting tired throughout, you can toe touch down and then go back up.
at the bottom. Please stop, God, please help me. <laughs> Not gonna help me now. Okay, Rita, what do we got next for you? We got the reverse plank, right? Squeezing your butt, put a penny up there, and squeeze, baby, squeeze. Woo! Two rounds done, and this is done, one to go. I see the light at the end of the tunnel, squeeze. Just think about that beautiful post-workout shake, maybe. Protein-infused carbohydrate meal you get to have after all your hard work. Best time to eat is around your workout. Let's go, I'm pressing it again. I don't want an extra rest time. I'm not gonna cheat. Last round, forward and back lunges. Let's rock and roll. I can't wait to eat after this. Forward and back, same way, come on. Go, come on. Hey, must be nice sitting in the chair. Come on, come on, push. I appreciate the cheerleaders though, I do. Having people cheer you on, right? Push, that's what I'm doing for you out there. I'm cheering you on. Do not stop, do not give up. Well, as I said, day four could be that breaking point. It won't be for you. Here we go. Push through this, we're almost there, come on. Push, did I say I would use a weight? This round, I lied, sorry. Push, push. See if I can write it down. If I don't write it down, it doesn't get done. You guys are doing amazing. Okay. We're almost there, guys. Come on, let's do this together. Finish strong with me. Nice long spine. Bad thing about my new haircut doesn't quite fit in a pony. Just a little nubby there. So I gotta wear it down. It's a little bit bothersome. Maybe I should just shave it off. What do you guys think? Yeah. Miley Cyrus? No, my dad would kill me. What's next? As you know, my least favorite. I'm gonna push through it for you guys. Okay, here we go. I'm not gonna talk. You got this, Rita. Go.
If you finish this with me, I'm super impressed because it ain't easy. And as I said, push through day four, get your mojo back. Don't let the weekend that's creeping up come in and all the temptations of the outside world. Okay, this is for you, it's a 30 day challenge. You can do it, okay? Let's rock and roll.